Robbie McEwen here, official ambassador for the Australian Unity Tour de Brisbane. Our journey since 2019 has taken us to the south and the west, and this year we're proud to explore new areas in the north and east and continue the tradition of riding our city where you've never ridden before. Beginning your ride at the Brisbane showgrounds, riders will dip straight into the inner northern busway at Hurston Station and ride under the city to Queen Street. From there it's around the Treasury Casino and through the CBD, back into the city's heart for the first time since 2019. We'll continue over the iconic Story Bridge and past the Kangaroo Point Cliffs before taking a sneaky entrance onto the South East Busway at South Bank. Riders will enjoy the dedicated bus lanes through the South East Busway and Eastern Busway to UQ Lakes before coming out on Doorknock Terrace and riding towards River Terrace in the West End, one of our city's favourite rides. From there, it's over the go-between bridge and up Hale Street towards the Legacy Way Tunnel, thanks to Transurban. It's a surreal experience riding through the tunnel and riders will come out the other end onto the Western Freeway. They'll be riding express to the Western suburbs and over the Centenary Bridge. Like the Oceania Road Championships last year, riders will continue onto the Centenary Highway before turning around on Sumner's Road and heading back over the Centenary Bridge up the Western Freeway and back into the Legacy Way Tunnel. It's a quick stretch of road along the inner city bypass as we duck underneath our showgrounds home and then past the new Green Bridge at Breakfast Creek and onto Kingsford Smith Drive. It's a fast and scenic ride along Kingsford Smith Drive and before you know it, we'll be turning left and heading along Southern Cross Way, another first. The Southern Cross Way section to the north towards the airport will welcome the United Airlines Runway Sprint. It's a time sprint segment competition with a green jersey up for grabs. Turning around at Toomble Road, riders will play out the same course in reverse, enjoying the river on your left hand side and passing the future site of the Olympic Athletes Village in Hamilton. From here, the shorter rides turn left and go to the showgrounds for the finish, while the 110 km course continues along the inner city bypass and takes a second trip through the Legacy Way Tunnel. Our friends at Transurban will make sure the tunes are pumping as you head towards Mount Cutha for the pointy end of the ride. The climb of Mount Cutha returns to an anti-clockwise direction with the tougher ascent of the mountain. That's followed by the longer and more gradual descent on the front side, which features scenic city views. Once again, there'll be a Champion of the Mountain segment with the coveted polka dot jersey being awarded on the podium. From there, it's a final trip through the Legacy where riders will get the final positioning for a sprint to the finish. Riders will take the technical turn at the Clem 7 interchange before turning onto St Paul's Terrace towards the new finish up King Street. After the finish, it's straight into the showgrounds arena for a cold beverage and catching up with your mates, and you'll be surrounded by the Brisbane Cycling Festival atmosphere. A huge thank you to our partners for their support in bringing this course together, and we can't wait to ride Brisbane with you on the 2nd of April, 2023.